What's up guys, Strax here. Today I'm going to show you guys on how to make this invisible torso green joggers outfit for your male character. So yeah, let's just go ahead and get into the clothing glitch. Now when you do get to the clothing store to get the green joggers, I will leave a link in the description so then you guys can go ahead and do the transfer glitch and get the green joggers. Just letting you know, you only have less than one more week to be able to get the green joggers until you have to wait next year unless director mode does come back or if you not do the Beth glitch. But other than that, you guys can't get the green joggers anymore. And the only downside about this glitch is if you are on old gen, that's the only time this glitch works. If you're on new gen, like Xbox Series X and S and PS5, this does not work. But this glitch does work on PC since Rockstar didn't give PC players the actual, I guess, advanced and enhanced version of GTA yet. So, but whenever you do have the green joggers and you do make it to the clothing store, go over here to the top section. Scroll down until you do find work jackets, which will be on slot 12, and you're going to look for the green jacket or the green kelvis or crevice, which will be right here. Yeah, crevice, green crevice core, which will be on slot 20, and you're going to want to go ahead and equip this work jacket. After you do equip this work jacket, you can then back out of work jackets. If it is closed, you can then just back out of the tops, pull up your interaction menu, go to style, scroll down to the bottom where it does say jacket, and if it is closed like this, just press right once on the d-pad just like that now you can go back into the tops scroll down until you do find designer t-shirts which will be on slot 31 click on designer t-shirts and you're going to look for the black print t-shirt on slot 59 when you do equip the black print t-shirt and you have the work jacket back out of the tops we don't need to worry about the pants since we already do have the black joggers go over here to your accessories click on gloves which will be on slot 7 and you're going to look for the black armored which will be on slot 9. After you've equipped the black armored gloves, that will be all for the accessories, so go ahead and back out. Walk over here to the shoes, go to sports shoes on slot 9, and equip the blue sports shoes on slot 59. Whenever you have equipped these sports shoes, you can then just back out and take off any head accessories that your character does have. So whenever you have done this, this is what your outfit should look like so far. After your outfit does look like this, walk up here to the front counter, hit edit saved outfits, and save the outfit on any slot that you want. Now that you have saved the outfit back out of your edit saved outfits, scroll down through the clothing until you find heist coveralls on slot 13. And scroll down from slot 9 through slot 12 and equip one of these outfits with the toxic mask. After you do equip one of these outfits, back out of the front counter and we're going to head over here to the pier to do the telescope glitch. After you do find a telescope on the pier, you're just going to want to do the telescope glitch. You're going to run past telescope like this, hit right on the d-pad, you'll see that your character runs in place, then look towards the telescope, that's how you know you're glitched. Pull up your interaction menu, go to style, and equip the outfit you just saved earlier at the clothing store, which will look like this. After you've equipped the outfit, put away your interaction menu, walk away from the telescope, and you will see that the mask equips on your outfit, just like this. All we're going to do now is just head to a gun store. Now that you're at the gun store, just go over here to the top section, hit edit saved outfits, and save the outfit on any slot that you want. After you do save the outfit, you can then just back out of your tops, and we're going to start up a job. So hit pause. Go to online, click on jobs, click on play job, click on Rockstar created, click on missions, look for the job that's called a titan of a job, and just fully start up that mission. When you load into the mission, you will see that you have an invisible torso. Now that you have the invisible torso, go over here to the tops, hit edit saved outfits, and save the outfit on any slot that you want, once again. Now that you have saved the outfit, back out of the tops, pull up your phone, and just quit the job from your phone. After you've quit the job and you are back in a public or an invite only session, you'll see that your torso is now visible again. Now all you want to do is run back inside the, the gun store and you're going to want to equip an outfit that has a belt. So like a cop belt or a paramedic belt. If you don't have any of those, you can walk over here to your outfits, go to the diamond casino heist, which will be on slot 52. And if you guys scroll down to the bottom, we're going to start with the first one, which will be the group A sex gear, which is on slot 20. And you can equip one of these outfits that has this type of belt. You guys are only able to unlock this if you do use them while doing the final part of the Diamond Casino Heist. But if you don't have these unlocked or if you don't, I guess, if you don't like them, you can back out, go to Maintenance, which will be on slot 18. And you can equip one of these type of outfits that has this type of belt. If you don't like these or if you don't have them unlocked, you can go to Prison Guards, which will be on slot 15. And you can use one of these outfits with this type of belt. So those are the only options you guys have unless you do have an outfit saved with a cop belt or a paramedic belt. But once you do equip one of those outfits, you can then just back out. But for me, I'm going to use an outfit that I already have with the cob belt. So this is the outfit I'm going to use. 
But yeah, so I will leave a link in the description. We're going to be doing the merge glitch. So I will leave a link in the description so then you guys can bookmark the job called It's a G Thing. And you guys can do that. But for me, I'm going to do the apartment merge. So I will get back to you when I am at my apartment. Whenever you do make it to your apartment, go into the heist planning board room and walk up here to the heist planning board. And then out of all the five heists started, the first one that's called the Fleeka job. After you start up the Fleeka job, the first job it's going to be due, it's going to be called Scope Out. When you complete the Scope Out mission, the second job it's going to be due, it's going to be called Kuruma. When you have the Kuruma job available, just launch that mission. Once you're in here, where it does share your heist clothing, set your heist clothing to player saved outfits. When you have set your heist clothing to player saved outfits, you can then confirm your settings and then invite whoever you want, like a random or a friend. And after someone does join, just launch the mission. When you do load into here where it does show your owned outfits, scroll to the slot to wherever you did save the outfit and your outfit should look exactly like this with the invisible torso. Now just hit ready to play. Once you have fully loaded into the mission, all you need to do now is just pull up your phone and just quit the job from your phone. So whenever you do load back into a public or an invite only session, you're going to want to find a car. It doesn't matter if it's your personal vehicle or a random civilian car on the street. But once you do find a car, go in and get inside that car, pull up your interaction menu and register as a secure serve or a motorcycle club. After you've done this, pull up your interaction menu up again, click on secure serve CEO or your motorcycle club, then go to management, go to style and on your CEO style or MC style, scroll one time to the left and then one time to the right back to none. Now hop into the car and you will see that you guys have an invisible torso on your outfit with the belt that you wanted to merge over with the green joggers. Now all we're going to do is go ahead and go to the clothing store so then we can get that mask for this outfit and the helmet. When you do make it to the clothing store, you're now going to want to go over here to the front counter, hit edit saved outfits, and save this outfit on any slot that you want. After you do save the outfit, make sure you have an outfit that only has a black bulletproof helmet. So just like this outfit right here, it only has the black bulletproof helmet. This would be a perfect outfit if you guys have one just like this. So after you've made sure that you have a black bulletproof helmet only on an outfit, you can then just back out of your edit saved outfits, scroll down to arena war, which will be on slot 51, go to bodysuit, which will be on the first slot and equip the blue and green nebula bodysuit on slot 16. After you've equipped this bodysuit, you can then just back out. And now we're going to head over here to the pier to do the telescope glitch. After you make it to a telescope on the pier and you guys are wearing the bodysuit, just do the telescope glitch. Go and run past telescope like this. Here right on the d-pad, you'll see that your character runs in place. Then look towards the telescope. That's how you know you're glitched. Pull up your interaction menu. Go to your style and equip the outfit that you guys have with only the black bulletproof helmet. So just like this. Now put away your interaction menu, walk away from the telescope, and you will see that the bodysuit mask merges with the black bulletproof helmet just like this. Now we're going to merge it over to the green joggers outfit. So just do the telescope glitch again, run past telescope, hit right on the d-pad, you'll see that your character runs in place, then look source the telescope. Now pull up your interaction menu, go to style, and equip the green joggers outfit that we did save earlier with the invisible torso, just like this, which should be this outfit. Now put away your interaction menu again, walk away from the telescope, and you should see that the black bulletproof helmet and the bodysuit mask merges over with the outfit, just like this. And that's pretty much it. So now you can just go to the clothing store, save it out in any slot that you want, and that's pretty much it. So if you are wondering what the outfit does look like in the pause menu, here you guys go. Pretty cool green outfit in my opinion. But yeah, I hope you guys do enjoy. Please like and subscribe. Thank you guys for watching. Peace.